Hey guys, it's Kevin with Mixed Coach. Today's trick is something that I just discovered this past week. And I don't know why I went so long without actually knowing this, but I did. I discovered it this week and I wanted to show you what to do. This is how to make your particular favorite plug-in that you pull up and use all the time like I do the SSL. Now I do the same thing to it all the time. I'll always, you know, roll the roll a little bit of the low end out of it. I'll run this threshold all the way to the top as you saw in the uh, instant awesome video that we did and I usually adjust this and it usually ends up around two to one and this all the way up. Uh, I'll usually split it and make the channel output so that the I think the EQ or the compressor happens after the filter. But this is the way it loads up all the time like that but I wanted to do the same thing so here is what I discovered uh, when you set it up let's just go ahead and set it up um, the way I just did I don't know why I just <laughs> let's do all this stuff that I normally do add a little top end to it take a little low end out of it uh, pull the output down a, d a db and a half or so and then I want this to I want it to happen just like this every time I pull it up so here's what you do you go to the top where it says preset at the top and you save the settings okay and you have to do this first then what you want to do is go open it again and hit say set as user default okay so then uh, it will come up this way now instead of the factory default so let's take this plugin off and then uh, let's let's open it again and look what happens boom it's just the way we left it and that'll happen no matter how many times you open it okay for instance let's just say that now you want to you want to open it up on all your channels okay and let's find a slot right here let's just say that right here on every slot you want it to happen just like this now it will open up on every channel and every channel will have your preset now if you don't do it this way it will come up and you'll have to do tweaking on every one of them which is like starting from ground zero so anyway this is how to make your preset come up when you instantiate a plugin I hope you get a lot of mileage out of it and I will see you soon okay bye